the craziest thing that I have seen in a very long time that you sent to me, yes, is it could potentially go down in history as the most famous reverb post ever. Yeah. Earlier today, our friend Josh from JHS Pedals put the first Klon Centaur ever made and sold on reverb. Yeah, so we should back up and talk about Klon Centaur for the non guitarists. It's the most copied, it's the most sort of it's um, the pedal that launched launched a thousand ships and a thousand clones and a thousand you know and it's 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 an overdrive pedal it's a boost pedal and you put it before your gain stage and it pushes power into your gain stage in a way that is i will admit very very tasty yes um and a million copies of, of it have been made different models have come out that clone the circuitry and the approach and the tone and everything and it's you can get a center uh, you know a clone Clone, clone clone is what they're called. Yeah, um, or just a clone. Or clone with a, with a K, right? Um, from a lot of different people. Uh, but this is apparently the very first one ever built. It's serial number two because the maker yes. held on to the serial number one to build one for himself later. But the very first one that yes. was built was number two, and it's presently for sale. And how much could you have it for, Adam? If you were interested in purchasing the very first clone Centaur ever made, from uh, Josh over at uh, JHS Pedals, it'll set you back a cool 500,000 US dollars. Yeah. With free shipping. Uh, no, he'll actually, shipping, he will yes, the hand deliver the it part. anywhere on the planet. Yeah. <laughs> Which is great. Yeah, so it's obviously like collector value is the, the biggest part of that. But but there are people who, you know, you find original Clon Centaurs for one to 5,000. Yep. The, you know, that's kind of what they go yeah. for. The interesting is that it's actually boosted the entire used market on Reverb. Yeah. Currently, the the cheapest used one is $5,400, sure. which, again, we were talking about this a couple episodes back. It was, you know, $1,800, right. you know, just, just a couple of years ago. Right. Let's go ahead and read the, the listing because it's... Delicious. It is so, yeah. It said, you know what it is. Yep. If you want the best clone, it's this clone. Bill built slash sold this number two first as he sat number one aside for himself and built it later. Because of the prices lately here on Reverb, I think this is a fair price for what it is. I only took one picture because that's good enough. <laughs> what you see is what you get. No box, nothing. Yeah. Just the pedal. Yeah. The pedal will be hand delivered by me in person to anywhere on earth for free. Yeah. Allow 30 days for me to clear my schedule and get it to you from the date of purchase. Buy it or don't. I don't really care. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And I will, or I won't. I don't really care. Yeah, it's great. A lot of gear guys are kind of saying this is basically like layers have kind of collapsed onto each other and we we have just, you know, we've fallen through the wormhole. Yeah, we, we went, you know, it's, after this it's like pedalception. Basically. Yeah. But you know what? He'll sell it. Oh, I'm sure it'll he will. Get, it'll get gone. I have no doubt. I have no I'm doubt. I'm just really curious to see who buys it. And, and that will be, you know, a story in itself. You know, it's it's funny when there's not shows and things to talk about, like the internet kind of takes over for all the interesting <laughs> things. That's true. It's like reverb listings and YouTube posts and, and you know, wow. name announcements. We've got to entertain ourselves.